Hi everyone, today I wanted to come over here and tell you all about a book I just finished. I finished this book yesterday, um, and this is the first book that, uh, the only book I had left that I brought to 2019 with me, and the reason why is that it was a big book, and that book is <clears throat> the Red Knight by Miles Cameron. Um, yeah. It's book one of the Traitor Sun Chronicles. Um, but anyways, that's what it looks like. I do have a physical book, but it's put away right now, so. I just decided to get it on Kindle, or get the cover on Kindle. Um, just show it on here. Anyways, if I will tell you it's a big book, it's a huge book, one that I don't get through. Uh, physically reading it for years, literal, literal years, um, the only way I got through it this fast is my husband let me get scribbed for the first time a couple months ago, and that's the first book I wanted to see if it was on there because I knew I couldn't read it physically, um, because it would take me a heck of a long time. But I did like it on Goodreads. I gave it a four star. My husband gave it a five star. But I don't like war books that much, but this one was pretty good. It is about war, and it's heavy on, like, war stuff, and it goes pretty in detail as to what they're doing or whatever, and how most of the people get killed, so, um, if you don't like gory stuff, you know, uh, stay away from it. But I did end up giving giving it a four stars. Um, my husband was kind of weirded out because I didn't like the book like he did. He gave it a five star, and I gave it a four. And that's all I have to say. That's all I'm going to say. Um, I think it was a good book for what it was. I'm just not really into war books like that. Um, you know, where all it is is people go into war and, you know, it had big, big words in it that I couldn't pronounce. Yes, I was in special ed, but that, you know, whatever. But that's why I got it on Scrib, just because it had big words that I couldn't pronounce. And reading it physically just wasn't wasn't cutting it. I almost DNF'd it several times because <coughs> I was trying to read it physically. Um, but I didn't, and that has to be because of my husband letting me get scribbed. So, um, a big thank you goes out to him. It is a good book, though. If you want to read it, you can. Just be warned about the things I said about it. It can be pretty daunting, um, it can be pretty boring at times, but, you know, um, 
some books can do that. But if you like it, you like it. And you should read it if you want to read it. Alright, um, I'll get off here and um, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.